What is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel with me Mrs. Z1. We are hopping into Sea of Stars and we are checking out their brand new co-op update with my husband Z1 Gaming. Sabotage Studios is actually sponsoring this video. So huge shout out to Sabotage Studios. If you guys are interested in checking out Sea of Stars, link down below. If you guys are interested in checking out uh, Z1 Gaming's channel, link down below to that as well. All right, so this is the Great Archives, and basically this guy is saying that we're going on a grand adventure. Um, it's basically a story that um, I believe we're living, so uh, we're going to kind of just skip through this because, you know, like I said, I'm a serial story, story skipper, so uh, <laughs> I'm excited for the gameplay. I want to see what the co-op mode's like. I'm really excited for it. Okay, so this is our first look at combat. Um, it is, I believe this is kind of like the little tutorial part, so we're going to attack the training dummy. Um, I'm playing on keyboard. Uh, Missy's actually, you're playing on a uh, controller, so it uh, looks like we're going to do a little healing action. Um, I, think you, I think I healed you for zero. <laughs> My healing abilities aren't very good. <laughs> and now we're doing a combo attack. Okay. So it looks like it might be, is it, is it turn-based combat a little bit? And then, like, it's like it's like free roaming, I think, too. So let's get through here and let's see what, uh, let's see what we're getting into. All right, we officially have Missy in the game. She's con she has control of her own character now. I'm the leader of the pack. <laughs> All right, I think we, I, I've been in there before. We don't need to talk to that guy. He just tells us that he does stuff. He's the farmer. I'm gonna guess there's gonna be like something saying, oh, we should go this way or do something. It's a really pretty game though. Um, okay. <laughs> they made a wrong turn. Oh. Hey, wait. Oh, you're supposed to read those. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Interesting. I like this cutscene. There you are. Playing your secret hideout again. Oh, they look fancy. They like, like they look like super magical fancy people. Come closer, Zayal. Open your palm and concentrate. Oh, I'm gonna learn magic. I've always wanted to learn magic on the side of a road with a complete stranger. Oh, so she's like training me and he's like training you. Oh, yeah, see, look at the blue and the blue. All right, this guy wants to hear a report. We are the solstice warriors. Um, Right away, headmaster. Uh oh. Once you enter the Zenith Academy, you'll wish you hadn't. <laughs> okay, so they're going to go talk about business business. Okay, so we left our city, and it looks like we have like an over, like an over map, like an overworld world map. Um, Forbidden Cavern. Okay, I think this is I, maybe this is our, our first grand adventure. Do we have to do something here? Uh, open the magical book. Oh, it's a save spot. <laughs> <laughs> we made it time to stop for a snack. Oh no, we got to open this giant myth mystical door. It's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. <laughs> Plus, I made something special for the occasion. Oh, sandwiches. It's the jam. I use a bit of sap from the Celestial Willow. Get in trouble for that? Only if you tell. <laughs> okay, it looks like your character is opening a door. Oh. You did some. Alright, looks like we made it inside the, the magical door. The Forbidden Cavern. <laughs> I wonder what's forbidden about it. Come on, Z, keep up. Uh-oh. Oh, we're fighting. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, we have turtles to fight. Magical turtles with magical shells. Or they're like, are those unicorn turtles? They have like a unicorn. They're like hedgehog turtles. No, they look more mm. like slugs. Maybe they're slugs. Uh oh, we have to fight. Yeah. Okay. So attack. We could choose which one we want to attack. Oh man. Um, I'm gonna guess. Okay, so there's one, two, and three. I'm gonna guess that's like the order they're gonna go in. Oh, that's how much health they. Oh, that's their turns. Okay. Should I go against the same for one? Um, I don't know. You might want to go. Out. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe go after that one. Oh my oh. gosh, our health is like super low. Garl. Oh, am I playing as him too? I guess. I guess go after that one. We're not ready for the. <laughs> yeah, I would say so. <laughs> it's preparing another attack. 
Watch out! Oh no! He yeah. lost an eye. Uh oh. I think he actually did lose, lose an eye. <laughs> <laughs> There's no escape. We're going down. Oh. I bet you the headmaster came and saved us. Yep. yep. Poor Garl lost an eye. Don't mess with spiky slugs. He'll lose an eye. Garl needs help. Feels better. Like anyone born in a moon cradle, a regular kid, what Garl needs is to not concern himself with the affairs of the celestial warriors. Really sorry. It was all my idea. Are you thankful the only cause of this lesson was an eye, young lad? He did lose it. <laughs> As for the two of you, if you are so eager to receive training, I shall oblige. Follow me. Okay, well, we got in trouble, so we lost an eye. Does Garl not get <laughs> training anymore? <laughs> I don't think Garl was a... I don't think Garl... I think Garl was a normie. <laughs> I think we're the magical ones and Garl's a normie. Uh-oh. Make sure to treat the wind to soothe the poor kid. Are we going to see him with an eye patch later? Oh, it looks like we're going off to training. Oh, I can I can feel the I can feel a time shift coming. We're gonna go off to training. We're gonna magically become older, and we're gonna see Garl. Garl's gonna become the villain. He's gonna have an eye patch, and he's gonna be the villain. <laughs> eye patches equal villain. Yep. <laughs> Don't forget about me. Never forget about you, Garl. You saved me and lost an eye. And magical teleport. Oh. Oh, we must be going up in like Sky Fortress. I think there was a floating Sky Fortress. Definitely looks like there is a floating Sky Fortress. Welcome to Zenith Academy. In this uh, ancient place of knowledge, you will learn everything you need to know in order to become a tr become true solstice warriors. We've been waiting for this for so long. When do we start? Right now. Oh, I was right. Oh, we're going up even higher. We're going to the top. The very, very top. Welcome to the classroom in the sky. We'll be studying here. Feeling a weird resonance like when I open the Forbidden Cave. Good on you for noticing that. Getting closer to the stars helps new recruits get acquainted with their innate magic. It shows great promise that you were able to feel it for and Zale too from what Erlina told me? I think it was Erlina. It was just a small burst. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. I'm ready. Let's learn the things to become the very best. Okay, so we can look around. Okay, so we have to pick a bed aligned with our innate magic. Oh, see, there's a moon and the sun. So I'm a, I must be a sun person. You must be a moon person. How do you know which side's which? This almost looks like the blue side. And the other side it looks kinda like does, the sun side, doesn't it? Yeah, but I don't think it's gonna let us go far enough away. Yeah, <laughs> <Nope>. <laughs> doesn't work. Okay, what happens here? Go to sleep. Yep. I don't know. We'll see what happens. The next morning in the training room. Oh, we're gonna learn to fight. It's our friend from earlier. So you'll be our trainer. Yes. Oh, I wish. Oh, they're leaving. They're not gonna be our trainer. I got a training sword. I got a staff. I'm oh. cooler than you. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, we're running. We're running. We're becoming. We're getting exercised. Don't give up now. Don't give up. So I'm apparently giving up. Don't do it. <laughs> up and down ladders. <laughs> up, down, up, down, up, down. Push ups and sit ups. Let's go. That was, wait, that was one day. Yeah, you feel like you're in basic training again? <laughs> I guess. Jeez. <laughs> feel free to take a break. Okay. I guess we're, we go back to our thing? I don't know. I'm lost. Oh. Ready to learn magic? Yes. Okay, we're done onboarding. I'm ready for some battle. I want some more fights. 
I think we could take the slug people now. <laughs> we could totally take them. We did 99 push-ups and sit-ups. We're good. <laughs> We're making a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars. No, we're making, like, magical cloaks and clothing. Okay, I'm walking around without you. I'm still at work doing yeah. stuff. <laughs> I'm still training. Get back to work. <laughs> oh, this is a save point. That's right. Oh. You keep saying that, but the Fleshmancer left our realm for good when the Dweller of Strife was destroyed. So why can't they have a normal life? Oh, we're, we're eavesdropping on some stuff. You know the three of us can take the one on Wraith Island. We don't need them. Prudence, Erlina, there is no telling what threats we may face in the future. Zale and Valerie were brought to Moon Cradle by the Great Eagle. It is not the place of the Headmaster to question such thing, and neither is yours. Won't you let this end? What about Mayor Mo Moyara? Mo Moyara? What about the twins? Do not judge a sacrifice you cannot pretend to comprehend. Okay. This conversation's over. They will study here while you carry on with your investigation. When the first eclipse after the training is complete, they will join us for the cleansing. <laughs> that sounds like a really bad time. Oh, and so they trained and weave for weeks and then for months. Look at us. We're becoming uber strong now. And we weaved. Don't forget that we weaved. I weaved longer than you, remember? I did. <laughs> I didn't weave as long as I should have. Focus and then release. We must be coming. We must be getting more magical. For the longer a dweller is left to its devices, the stronger it gets. Let one grow for too long, and you have a world eater on your hands. Against such a foe, even with a legion of solstice warriors, would be helpless. Uh, since delaying only increases the chances of a world eater, cleansings always target the strongest dweller known to us. Dwellers are immune to our magic. How can we fight them? That's why cleansings are always performed during a total eclipse. In these moments only, dwellers lose their immunity. Oh, so cleansing is meant to take out the uber bad guys. Just the one known as a dweller of woe. We cannot be done for sure. The Fletchmancer just may have planted another other seeds of evil before leaving our world. Well, let's see what we let's see what this cleansing does. Oh, I thought we were doing the cleansing. I was excited for cleansing. A few days later, a sound in the night. What's it? See I'll wake up. Did you hear a voice coming from the entrance? I did. <laughs> <laughs> Time is it? Who cares? Let's go check it out. Are you hearing voices at night again? I am. It's a problem now. Uh, this way. One slow poke. Keep up. Keep up now. It's all that weaving. <laughs> it's all that weaving. My legs aren't as strong as yours. <laughs> At the entrance, right? Oh. Look. There's a thing. What? I don't know. It smells good. Is it from our friend? Is it Gale? It's Garl. <laughs> you already <laughs> forgot his name and he lost an eye for us. Oh, wow. It's Garl. <laughs> Sale Valerie. If you're reading this, it probably means I got caught. I'm writing this as a failsafe, but I hope to see you in person. Uh oh. I made cookies filled with Celestial Willow. Damn, you like? Oh. I'm doing everything I can to be ready to leave when you graduate. In the meantime, I hope your training is going well. Uh oh. Now the platform is almost up and I can see Moraine is there waiting for me. He looks very angry. I'll try to drop the jar without him noticing. I guess that means I won't be able to try to visit you again, but I'm thinking of you every day and I can't wait. How's your eye? <laughs> you didn't even tell us how his eye was. It's gone. <laughs> what is there to tell? There's nothing to talk about. <laughs> your friend until the end of time. Garl, he's definitely he's definitely a villain. <laughs> Let's go up to the disc and eat him. Oh, we got a cookie jar. We got a cookie jar. We're gonna eat him at the very top. I feel like that jam is gonna do something. Uh, yeah, it's gonna cause uh, something to happen. You know, I wonder. It said 
it looked like we were able to play three player. What happens if somebody was Garl? <laughs> I can't see half the screen. <laughs> Well, will they not be a part of the story anymore? That's what I was getting at. I don't know. Because <laughs> well, they said it was just human, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe like after you get past this part, there's like actual like gameplay, and like he's like the something or other. Because he said he was training too. Oh yeah. He said he was waiting for us for years. We trained and weaved for years. You look older. Oh yeah. Until one day, we could weave no longer. Oh. That's the one. You feel it too, hold on. There it is. Let's go see the headmaster. We have fancy capes now. Ooh. Look at us all big and strong. I wonder how Garl is. <laughs> a villain? He's becoming a <laughs> villain. I'm telling you. Mr. Headmaster. We've finished our weaving after five years. I think we're ready. Why, yes. Tingling of magic in the air has been building up for a few weeks now. Congratulations. Moving forward, there will be no more weaving. I can deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like to weave. You had me doing your weaving, too. That's true. <laughs> you kept on dipping out. Uh, Leave on our journey to meet the Elder Mist. Let's do that. I'm ready for our journey. You go... Both grown pregnant. Did you guys just get back? Did they go get milk? <laughs> they never came home. <laughs> they finally decided they fi to. <laughs> they finally came home. <laughs> Are here to help to review the basics of combat. Checking with them. In the okay. Uh, ready. Let's go. Uh, I don't think so. I think we're good. Let's just send it. I mean, your uh oh hits and blocks is important. Are you sure you don't want to review this? Do we want to review? Nope. Let's just send it. We are professionals. We're professionals. We've I have a staff and you have a sword. We're we've, good. We've been doing it for years. <laughs> okay. We I, we did it. We talked to both of them. Yeah, we're ready. Let's do it. Final test. Here we go. Then let us begin. So I think that's why there was the numbers on the things. And when they get down to one, I think you do probably a block. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, yeah. We're tested. We're ready. So that I may use my agility to cleanse this world and protect my companions, I will enter the world... As a blade dancer. I choose the curved blade as it will not hinder my speed or reflexes. Oh. Welcome, blade dancer. <laughs> Shark bait. Ooh, ah. So that I might use my strength to inspire hope and eradicate evil, I will become a battle monk. I'm jealous I want to be a battle monk. <laughs> I choose the staff where it won't break and no matter how hard I strike. Welcome, I battle monk. Ooh, ah. I told you I'm cooler than you. I know. Is my staff going to look like his? Probably not that fancy. Maybe if I was a better weaver. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Get into this. Oh. That's a long fall. Alright. Uh, I'm getting guess we go this way. This must be our- is this our final test? Oh wait, we gotta go up? Looks like, is this a ladder? Yeah. And then we have a lever. Oh. Um. <laughs> I don't think we want to put the cookie jar there. You went the wrong way. Oh, dang. Well, I don't I know. Did. Maybe you did. No, I, found I an did. an ornate stone. Well, I think I can put the ornate stone back in here now. I have to wait for you, though. Boop. You bubbled. Ornate stone. <gasps> We've done it. We've passed our test. <gasps> turtle men. Turtles. It's the ninja turtles, but they're bad. Oh. All right. Oh, it's time. Okay. Attack. This one. <laughs> They're both attacking me, and you were the one who attacked them. <laughs> they both came How did that me. work? <laughs> I guess you should hit the same one. <laughs> um, I have skills to heal. I think I have a. I think I have a healing skill. Oh, it's your. It's. It's your turn. As you? I don't know. I don't know if you want to heal right. 
All right, one turtle's gone. What do you know? You chose me to come after me. So this is kind of interesting because you are able to play. Well, I don't know why. It's me. like it's swapped. Oh, you think it's just a, a glitch? Could be. We survived. We did it. Uh, where do we go? Oh, climb. Oh. Look at this go. It's a good thing I did all this push ups. Wouldn't be able to, or and climb the ladders. Wouldn't have been able to jump across this. Oh, <gasps> rope. Careful, don't fall. I'm gonna guess it's an ornate stone. <laughs> wow, you're smart. Oh, <gasps> hurry up! The turtles are after me now. Again. <laughs> okay. Um. Uh, so. Can you heal? Can you heal me up? I wonder how much it heals. What well, doesn't heal all that much? <laughs> oh my gosh! All three of them are going after you now. Yep, I'm a popular person. What can I say? <laughs> um, what skills do you have? Crescent art and a moon ring. Let's see. Smashes enemies in an arc. Lunar magic projectile that can bounce to multiple targets. Okay. Oh. That was kind of cool, not gonna lie, though. I know, if I want to mess it up, I probably could have did it again. Oh, now you're back at being yourself. Okay. So... Uh, let's see what my skills are. Healing light. Oh! You have to have mana points. Okay. So it takes eight mana points for that one and four for that one. So... Um, I'm a little worried that if I don't use... Can we combo? Oh, we do have a combo. Do we want to use a combo on one of them? Do we use it on this one that we didn't hit before? Maybe? It's not dead, though. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. my gosh. Oh. Good luck. Items. What does the tomato club do? Does that heal? I think that heals you. Did I do it? I'm yeah. down to three. You should use it. Oh, that, that was, was good. quite a bit. Oh, now it's my turn. Um, I do the same thing. Probably. I don't think you want to die. <laughs> I don't think I want to <laughs> die either. And now we're just gonna get smacked again, though. <laughs> Should I attack? I guess. I mean, if we're gonna, I, I guess. I mean, we did we're combo gonna... on that guy. His health yeah. is probably down the lowest. Take him out. Um, do I have something that I can... Oh, well, I probably should use the light on you, huh? Probably. Because I think you might have more mana points next turn. You might be able to do that arc blade thing again. You might be able to hit both of them again. <laughs> Skills. Yeah, the moon ring. You have to time it when the thing, so good luck. Have fun. Or you could do that one, I don't know. I kinda wanna try this one. Try it. Oh, it's highlighting that. Oh. Oh, is it it's probably showing that it's gonna hit both, maybe? Hit it. Let's go down. Oh. Oh snap. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was good stuff right there. Okay, so now we can do this. <laughs> Our health is so terrible, though. All right, put the ornate stone in there. Do we like? Is there like? Is there a way for us to heal? Like, can we? Like, is there? Hit enter. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I don't know if we have like an inventory that we can like access the. Maybe we heal up over time. They haven't been to the other side of the Forbidden Cave yet. How could they understand? So you don't think we should at least try and explain? We've seen how strong they are. Word will be a walk in the park. Okay. Let's see them off then. Look how strong we look. We look awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's like now we're gonna have a boss fight. Oh yeah. Now it's a boss fight when we have no health. <laughs> Exam mode engaged, brace yourselves. Oh, wonderful. Oh, we got full health. Full mana point. 
shuffle weakness physical so oh you're we're you're, swapped again you're swapped again okay um does the combo take any extra mana point i it, it uses a combo meter i think on the side you might as well start off with it why not hit it And then we just hit an attack again. Oh, he only hit for six. He's weak. Those, are, those little spiky turtles did more damage than that. He said, now that his weakness is sun, it was, I think last oh. turn his weakness was moon with me. It said physical. Last time it said physical. Oh, well, he so said. Hey, go to skills, see what, and then do sunball. That sounds like a. That sounds like a fire thing. Hold A for power. Maximum power! Oh, wow. 27. So, I don't think I have a skill that is fire. No, because see, it says effect, and it says above moon. So, maybe we just attack. And I bet you next time it's going to be the moon one. Because I'm pretty sure it said the first one was physical. Yeah, see? Shuffle weakness. Moon! Oh. So now you could use the whatever you want to do. Oh, it didn't let you. See, now it's a physical attack again. Don't know. I don't know why I would have skipped you. <laughs> uh, power, 100%. I guess go for an attack. Oh, that didn't take. That didn't take a um a sword away. Energy release. Uh oh. That only did five damage. I wish you could see his health bar. Yeah, I kind of do too. Like I don't know how much health this guy has. Oh. That four oh, that was it. We won. Okay. That was a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> the turtles were harder. I know. I think so too. Uh, level up. Oh my gosh. Plus three physical defense, plus two physical attack, mana points, magic. Well, I'm a sword person, so let's go with attack. Uh, do hit points. You shall survive. Congratulations. You have been trained well. Oh, we're turning the headmaster. We passed the final exam. We did it. Okay. Let us into the real world now. We did it. We did it. In record time. You it must... was years. <laughs> <laughs> it took years. You must now learn of your ultimate power, the ability to use magic without using magic. But that knowledge is for the Eldermist to impart? Okay. Come, the villagers have gathered to celebrate your departure. Oh, are we going to see Gale? Garl. Garl? <laughs> I'm sorry, Garl is just such a weird name. I don't know, is Garl here? Where is he? I don't even see him. Garl never showed up. Garl was nowhere to be seen. I'm telling you, he's turning into the villain. You didn't talk to me for years. <laughs> I was left with one eye. <laughs> okay, we gotta go to the mist now. Go through the Forbidden Cavern on top of the mountain trail and seek audience with the Elder Mist on how to use magic without using magic. It's weird though, because he can't be the bad guy because like I said, it looks like there's three spots for people to play with. Oh, we got three tomato clubs. We got Solstice, oh, Solstice Diplomas. We graduated. And we unlocked relics. May you cleanse this world. <laughs> I think they want us to cleanse the world. There's a chest right there. There is a chest right there. We must be able to come back later and get it. Maybe when we talk to Garl. <laughs> I think Garl is long gone. I think Garl's gone. Maybe he didn't. Maybe his, he, same, he did he succumb to his eye wound? He, he got an infection. <laughs> He's going to be in here waiting for us. All right, let's go into the cave. I'm telling you, Garl's going to be in here. Like many years ago, I came to this cave and lost an eye due to these spiky slugs. <laughs> but now, I am ruler of the spiky slugs. All right, let's see. Let's see where, where I'm telling you, it's gonna happen. Raiden right Cave. Nothing. Okay, I guess maybe we have to go in here. Garl, are you in here? Oh, it's fight time. Here we go. 
here we go. Um, oh yeah. Do I you. attack that first one or do I attack the one that has the two boxes? I don't know. Hit the first one. That one's that one has a timer on it. it apparently isn't enough damage. I wish I knew I wish we could see how much health they had. Um oh you know what? We use a skill. Your the hammer thing. The arc? Yeah, the the arc thing. We hit that guy and then we'll hit that one. Yeah. Slash. Ooh. Bike shower? Oh my god. <laughs> so that's what that 100% power thing is? Like if you don't knock them down, they have a special ability maybe? Uh, maybe, I don't know. Um... Did that work? Let's see. So if I hit with this, is that gonna count as one of those things? Okay, it did. <laughs> one turtle left. They're slugs, not turtles. They're slugs. <laughs> Alright. Um, oh, there's a wall. Okay. So I think you need to wait. Jump up on here. Oh, never mind. I guess we can come over now. I just had to, we just had to stand on there long enough to um, do the entire thing. Actually, you know what? If I just go off the screen, you'll bubble to me. <laughs> come here. Come to me. <laughs> oh my goodness. There's a few turtles here. Slugs. Slugs. <laughs> oh. Hit the one in the middle. That's all. Very nice. I'm gonna attack that one because I have the sword, so I'm guessing I need to hit the sword thingy. If I break that, maybe that stops me from doing uh, maybe a specialty thing. So I also think there's a, a timing thing associated with the when those spike things come and hit us. We have the we have the tomato club that we can heal with. Yeah, but we're gonna get hit three times for at least five damage each. Uh, you might Is that even going to be the tomato? You better heal. Maybe I should attack one? What happens if you die, though? For science. I guess the middle one. Well, you smacked that one a second time. Okay, do that one. Get him. Take him out. Oh, it did. It worked. Oh, you want they're all... Oh, God. <laughs> they're all going to go after you anyways. So. <laughs> oh, we're still alive. We're still alive. Um... Do we attack or do we? I mean, if I, we have, you know what? Maybe, maybe we should heal first. Huh? You also have your uh, healing full, full thing. Yeah, but that'll only heal. That'll. Well, that's true. You know what? Maybe I should just attack. I'm gonna attack this one for science. Oh, oh, you have time to attack. Yeah, get him. Be gone. <gasps> you dropped a bag. <laughs> he dropped his sack. We got it. <laughs> of tomatoes. How do you get up to the thing? Maybe we can go this way, like this. Jump down. Hit the... Oh, did we have a key? I don't know. It's locked. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the key, okay. Um, I think we need to... What what did we do with this? Maybe you need to come stand on this thing with me. Uh, do we need to hit the thing? I don't know. Oh! oh. There it went. Okay, so now if we get off of it, and now we hit this... Oh! Okay, hold on. We need to hit it again. Okay. Alright, hold on. Stay here. Because only needs one of us. We need to hit this, and then we can go and get that chest up top. Ta-da! Now we can go up here, and get the chest. Yeah! We got the Forbidden Cavern Key. Now, why don't you stay here? 
Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. We both have to interact with it anyways. We do this. That resets it. Oh, ho, ho. Forbidden cavern key. Oh, look at that. Secret room. <gasps> that looks like a staff. You should grab that. It's like a scroll, no? Oh, was it? We learned a combo skill, mending light. Oh, that sounds like it's going to heal us both at the same like, time. That sounds like a healing thing. <laughs> Is there a chest right there, too? There is. We got a shiny pearl. What is this? Uh, mushroom soup. Very nice. So... I think we have to go up. Oh, yeah. Up. There's a chest over there. Uh, leeching thorn. Hmm. I didn't guess we have to step on that. <gasps> Sorry, I didn't realize he was leaving Whee! you. <laughs> That's okay. Uh-oh. They're back! <laughs> the slug unicorns. The slug the slug accords. <laughs> um oh it's you. Um We can probably <laughs> do the combo and the uh -oh. oh we don't have enough. Oh it takes all three. Holy moly. Okay. I feel, um, I feel like I'm gonna have to do the mending light. Probably. Or the healing one. Or just eat a tomato thing. Well, it doesn't matter anyways, because the tomato thing uses your turn. Right. So might as well save that. Yeah, but you need one now, too. Unless you want to kill me. No. Oh, <laughs> this recovers 40 HP. We're gonna, wow. use that. We're gonna use that one on you. We're gonna make you all fancy. Look at that. Oh, oh, it did both. Did you do both of us? Yeah, look, both of our HP went up. Holy cow. We're gonna need it, though. Spike shower. Yeah, see, I hit a check. I hit something, and I got a check mark that I that I like ev evaded or something. Okay. Oh, you can you can uh, you can hit when they're about to attack you. You can time it and hit um hit to and like to avoid or something. I'll show you. Hold on. Let's go to uh, skills. Let's see, will this do. Okay, so that's not gonna do anything. Yeah, the moon ring. That's to deflect, okay. Oh, Tried. You took one out. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Um. I'm gonna hit this one. I don't think I have. I mean, I guess. Well, you know what? There's no one's going. Hit it. Nice! Look at us. Another sack. We're learning things. You know, if we would have done the training like we were supposed to, <laughs> we probably would have figured out the whole, like, you know, blocking stuff. That would have been no fun, though. I know. Uh, Vice is broken. Can't activate the bridge. Let's go around. Ooh. Uh-oh, there's a save spot. You know what that means. That means we're about to have a boss fight. And it's gonna be Garl. <laughs> I'm just saying, look at there's a campfire. Campfire feels cozy and warm. Oh, let's rest. Oh, is this gonna reset our our uh, HP? Maybe. It is. Garl. Sounds big. Get ready. Oh. Oh, it's a giant. Oh, it's a giant worm. You know they did say something about a worm, huh? Okay. Um, do we want a combo or do we want to save it for that other thing? I think we need to save it in case I, this I thing is save, gonna. I think we need to save it too. Did he attack? Did I take some damage when I hit him? Yeah. It looks like you normally do too. I wonder if I can do this multiple times at the same target. The I would moon think. Ring? I would think so. We try it? Yeah. Send it. Alright, here we go. I said that he was boss slug. He's the boss slug. Holy cow, you're getting good at that. Oh! I tried. Oh, he spit on me! <laughs> um, oh. Uh, sunball? Do we sunball it? Sunball it up. 
Ah. Ooh, that was a good. That was pretty good. Oh, actually, you can use your moon ring too. I'm I like I'm gonna be super bad at it. We're just gonna <laughs> use the arc so I don't uh, embarrass myself. Seventeen damage. Let's go. Oh, that was a double spit on me. <laughs> it was a, a double spinner. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm just gonna attack it. Oh, you're. This is you. Acid bug bombs. Oh, uh, see, now we have multiple enemies, huh? Um, do we want to select an acid bug bomb? Boss bug, boss slug. <laughs> Do we take out a, do we do the acid things or do we just focus damage on this guy? I don't know. Just focus it. Hit him with everything we got. Uh oh. I don't think I have any skills that are gonna. I mean, I have, I guess, uh, I have healing light. You know what? Hmm. Maybe we can wait on that. If you take out the boss, it'll get rid of the little guys, right? Bloop. My health, like, super low. Oh, you should eat a thing and then. <laughs> Yeah, so there you can um, yeah, use that. So right before they attack you, I think you can hit your button and it will uh, you can take less damage. See how I, well, I did hit it, but <laughs> hit him. You got this. Oh, actually, maybe you should heal. Combo max. We can do the. Oh, do it, do it. Yeah. Was it? Oh, it was a combo. And then mending, mending light. Yes. Yep. Gonna heal us both, isn't it? Oh, it did max Holy health. Holy moly, that was fancy too. <laughs> All right, I'm going for the moon ring again. Here we go. Let's do this. <laughs> Fifteen times. <laughs> We've got to be. I mean. We've got to be getting there, right? I don't know. This is not a training boss. That's true. Sunball. Acid bug bombs again. Uh, I'm just gonna go hit hit him. Oh my gosh! His four power things. I hope we're getting towards the end of him. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, oh, you know what? That would actually be good. Let's do that. Press an arc. Let's go. I yeah. Ooh, 22. And it counted on that, too. Oh, do we want to do a combo? Probably, huh? Yeah. Oh, what do we do? What do we do? We have a combo. Maybe we can actually kill it. Did oh, we, do it? we did it! We did it! Oh my goodness, we survived. Just barely. <laughs> Yay! Our first big one. <laughs> we did it! We did it! Okay, so now what do we do? I don't know about you, but all that weaving did prepare me for this. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? We we're good to go now. Okay, what's through the door? There's gotta be some big epic thing, right? Oh! Scary people. Garl. <laughs> Things are starting to move. I'm eager to see what these two can do. I'm telling you, Garl's right. This is Garl. Those people have three eyes. He was missing an eye. I'm telling you, it's Garl. <laughs> That's why he wasn't there. That's pretty cool. But. I think we're going to go ahead and end it there. Well, that's going to end it. Thank you guys so much for coming out and watching. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like. If you haven't already, maybe consider subscribing. It does help out a lot and it is very much appreciated. If you guys want to check out the game for yourself, Sea of Stars, link down below in the description. And once again, another huge shout out to Sabotage Studios for sending us keys to the game and for sponsoring both of our videos. And I'll see you guys all in the next episode. Bye, everybody.